All right, so here he is, the consensus greatest mixed martial arts athlete of all time, UFC light heavyweight champion, John Jones. It has been a remarkable career. The toughest fight he has had came against you. He is trying to add to his legacy here tonight in what is yet another big spot for Johnny Brooks. John Jones is a guy that has reached the true pinnacle of mixed martial arts. No matter what he was going through outside of the octagon, the moment he stepped foot in there, he was just the best of the very best. I shared the octagon with him twice, and I have never felt that I was getting attacked by so many different things. He's a phenomenal mixed martial artist, truly deserves to go down in the UFC Hall of Fame. A champion now was a champion before, one of the longest reigns in UFC light heavyweight history. And it's one thing to have length, it's another thing to use it as well as he does that 84-inch reach. Certainly one of many tools in the vast arsenal of Johnny Bones Jones. All right, so here he is, one of the better offensive takedown guys we have in the UFC DC. And if anyone is well equipped to speak to this, it is you. The opponent knows what's coming. At least to this point in the UFC, no one's been able to stop. He just has to keep him away. Because the moment this guy gets close enough to either grab a leg or make body contact, right. now you're in trouble. He has a knowledge and an understanding of position from a lifetime of just all grappling, judo, wrestling, uh, Sambo, he does it all, and he has just so many ways to get you to the floor. This guy once told me that if he can get your leg, he's going to finish. Right. Because he's going to give you so many things to think about, you will not be able to process and keep up with him, and eventually you're on the mat. It's unbelievable to watch him apply that knowledge to the mixed martial arts fights. And as the wrestlers say, this is not a guy you want anywhere near your bracket. No, you don't want him in the bracket. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. When the action begins, our referee in charge of the Octagon, Herb Dean. And now, this is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. Live from the sold-out Toyota Center in Houston, Texas. It's time! Five rounds for the undisputed USC Heavyweight Championship of the World. It's the see fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a look-see dude fighter. Only a professional record of 27 wins, one loss, and one no contest. He stands six feet four inches tall, weighing in at 225 pounds. Fighting out of Albuquerque, New Mexico, USA, presenting the challenger, John Bones Jones! And now introducing the champion, fighting out of the right corner. This man is a wrestler, holding a professional record of Five wins, three losses. He stands six feet three inches tall, weighing in at 265 pounds. Fighting out of Regina, Saskatchewan, Canada. Ladies and gentlemen, presenting the reigning, defending, undisputed UFC heavyweight champion of the world, This is for the championship. You've been given your instructions in the dressing room. Protect yourself at all times. Follow my instructions. We will have a clean fight. Touch gloves. Let's make it official. Ready. You ready to fight? All right, so the fight is now underway. On one side, you have a fighter who does everything well, taking on a true grappler on the other side. It's going to be interesting to see how long it will take it up. Oh, nice job to defend the takedown. He's to his feet. Well, he continues to find the openings tonight. Beautiful connection with the punch there. Accuracy at its best. Well, if you like Muay Thai striking, this might be your moment in this fight as he gets the title. This is a massive moment for this fighter. He's a great Muay Thai fighter. Look for him to go knee-knee and then try to land a big one to the head. All right, he closes the distance, gets the single collar tie. Right punches there. 
a nice job at least staying upright on that. Jones leaning on the kicking game here tonight, DC. Pretty good strategy early. And that is usually what he leads with. He's a great kicker. He's a guy that has a variety of kicks. Spinning kicks, keys, side kicks. He kicks in so many ways that you never truly know where he's coming from. So just over 20 total strikes have landed for Johnny Bones Jones. Effective punch there by Johnny Bone. Yeah, he's fixing it all up. him with the straight. Nice job there by Jones. Yeah, it looks a little wobbly on his feet. He's in trouble. He's hurt this is combo there. Oh! Great punch. Now goes in and secures the takedown. A minute and a half to go in our opening round. Oh, really nice work to keep busy off of his back as he lands some more offense here from Bob. submission tonight, champ. I mean, you know this guy has such a great submission game that you cannot lay in his guard. He's so skilled, he's so tricky, and he's so good at weaving a web that gets you lost in it that he made him pay for it tonight and got the submission victory. So there he is, the baddest man on the planet, UFC heavyweight champion of the world, a title that every heavyweight wants. He has it after the win by submission here tonight. He leaned on the grappling, and he got the job done in a big way. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Herb Dean is going to stop in this contest at four minutes, 35 seconds of the very first round. For the winner by submission, and new undisputed UFC heavyweight champion of the world. So how about it, there is a 